planner friends, it's Ashley. In this video, I want to share with you some sticker storage ideas and show you kind of my favorite ways that I like to store my stickers here in my craft room. Now, the first thing that we're going to start with is the Happy Planner sticker storage box. If you know me and you've been following me for a long time, then you know 99% of my stickers are from the Happy Planner. I love their stickers so, so much. And then when they come out with the sticker storage box, I knew I had to get them. I love this box. It holds a ton of different stickers. It's really super cute. And as you can see, I have three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 sticker books inside of this one box. And there's still plenty of room for more stickers. So this will definitely hold a ton of sticker books. I love these sticker storage boxes. I will link them down below in the description box. So you guys can check those out. But that's my first way. Now the next one that I have is this cute wire basket that I picked up from Target. This is a really cute basket. It is this really pretty blue. I think they had some other colors as well. If I can find this one or something similar to it, I will link it down below in the description box. But honestly, Target has a lot of different baskets and crates and stuff that are really cute. That would be cute to store your stickers in. I personally like to keep my memory keeping stickers in here, keep those separate. So when I sit down to do memory planning, I just grab this whole little crate off my shelf and then I have all my stickers there together. Now I do obviously pull out other sticker books because I we, we gotta use all the stickers, right? Um, but I mainly keep memory keeping stickers in here and then I also have my alphabet stickers in here because I use those a lot with memory keeping. So that's another way and I've actually seen some little wire baskets like this from Walmart that are really cute. So you guys can check those out um, as well at Walmart and see if you can find something there. But wire baskets are a great way to store stickers. And I like the size of this one because like I said, I, I like to just keep memory keeping stickers here and it holds plenty of them for me. So that's that one. Now the next wire basket I have also came from Target, but I actually seen these exact same baskets at Walmart and as you can see, that holds a lot of stickers and it's not even full yet. There's still plenty of room. Actually, the stickers are falling down. These are a little, a little bit dusty. These are my OG Happy Planner stickers. So if we was to stand these up, which I'm struggling to do here, I mean, you can kind of see. There's still plenty of room for tons of more stickers inside of here. So I really love this basket. It is, it's gray here and then it's got these rose gold handles on them and these slip great into a calyx shelf if you have calyx um, shelves which those are from ikea but even if you didn't have a calyx shelf this would actually look cute setting on your desk and it's going to hold a lot of stickers so i love this basket got it from target but walmart has the exact same ones another way that i love to store stickers are with these little containers from ikea i love these little containers so much so here's what they look like these ones are um i don't remember exactly what they're called that's the number for them i will link it down below though so don't worry there's actually two different sizes so here's the smaller one and then here is a bigger one which you can't even see it all on the screen so i apologize for that let me see if i turn it this way so there's the big one and then there's the smaller one. So obviously the big one's gonna hold a lot more stickers. So let me show you. These ones, I like the big ones too because you can actually do a couple of rows of stickers. So you can do all your stickers like that, where you have two rows inside of the container, or if you wanted to, you could always turn them this way as well. And so as you can see, that's gonna hold quite a few stickers. Now I like the little ones. Let me move this one. Okay, I like the little ones because these are like the perfect size for a row of sticker books. And as you can see, this one little container holds all those sticker books and there's still, you probably still get at least two more sticker books inside of there. So I really like these little containers from Ikea. These things are awesome. I actually keep these stickers here inside of this one and it stays on my rolling cart because these are the like student and teacher sticker books that I use for my son for virtual learning. So I keep all of those separate 
and I usually just lay them like this inside of that cart because there's not enough. If I stand them up, they're just going to end up like falling over anyways. So I leave them this way. You could always stand them up this way too if you wanted to. But these stay on my rolling cart. It fits great inside of those rolling carts. And I just keep, I like to keep them like with these little containers sectioned out if I have stickers in different places. Now another thing that I like to do with these little containers is I keep loose stickers and sticky notes in them. And also these little inspiration cards from the Happy Planner. And I also have some labels in here, but these are a lot of stickers that I used a lot throughout nursing school. So I kept all of these in binder clips inside of here. So if you have loose stickers, this these little containers are a great way to store them. So I also like to use them for that. And as you can see, it's gonna hold a lot of stickers inside of there. So those are the containers from Ikea. All right, the next sticker storage idea is a box from Hobby Lobby. Hobby Lobby has a ton of different boxes, a ton of different styles. I love these boxes. Now, I actually don't store stickers inside of here, but stickers will fit, and I have a couple of different ideas for how you can do stickers. But for me, in this size box, I keep all of my dashboards. I was losing dashboards like you lose socks. <laughs> So I picked up these boxes and I was like, you know what? This is perfect to put all of my dashboards in one place. So if I need a dashboard, I hop inside of here and I pick it up. So I really like this, but your sticker books will also fit in here. Now you might be thinking, Ashley, I don't want to stick my stickers in a box and have them hidden where I can't see them. But for me, I actually thought about doing this. I think I'm going to take all of my OG sticker books and put them inside of a box like this. That way I have that wire basket free so I can start putting some of my newer sticker books in there because I'm not really using those older ones. So I think that this is a great way to do that, but you can also store loose stickers inside of here. So kind of like I did from this little thing where I had all of those. If you wanted to pick some of these up, these boxes and put these inside of there, that would be a great way to do it too. Because I've heard from a lot of you that you don't have an Ikea close to you to pick up these. The closest Ikea to me is two hours away. The closest Hobby Lobby is 40 minutes. So I'd rather drive 40 minutes and pick up a box than two hours to get one of these. I mean, I like these, these are super cute, but these are also, these will also work great. So nothing wrong with those. Now these come in many different sizes. I really like this one for dashboard, but there's also, a smaller one let me put it down here so I can show you the well I can kind of show you the size comparison sorry everything's off screen here now this one I don't have planner supplies in I mainly have gum in it which I had forgot I had but um, this is great too I like these little ones sticky notes and uh, labels and your little loose stickers sticker sheets like this is the size of a happy planner sticker sheet that fits in there perfectly you can also put some of your um, sticker books like if you want to have one of these boxes just for memory keeping stickers that would be a great thing to do too so that's another idea I really do love these boxes from Hobby Lobby I think they're really cute they're super functional and they will hold a lot of things and then the lid of it is magnetic so the lid just flips down and they're cute like those are really really cute looks cute setting on the shelf too so that's another idea and the last idea I want to show you is using the rolling carts. Now, currently, my rolling cart has all of our homeschooling supplies on it, and I don't want to take all of that apart just to put stickers in. So I'm going to show you some pictures that I found online of some different ideas and ways that you can store your sticker books inside of a rolling cart because these little carts are awesome. And the best part about these carts is that you can take them anywhere in your house whenever you're planning. You just roll them around the house and you've got all your stickers in one place. There's three tiers, so you can put maybe your least used stickers at the bottom, and then ones that you frequently grab in the middle, and then the ones that you grab a lot in the top tray, in the top tier of it. So I think that those rolling carts are a great idea for sticker storage. I'm just currently not doing it because I needed a place to put homeschooling supplies so we, we can travel like from the office when we're um, doing homework and then also sometimes we work in the kitchen table so that was just a really functional way for me to use my rolling cart right now but I do love the idea of having stickers in it and maybe once this virus goes away and my son goes back to school I will convert my rolling cart into a sticker cart I think that would be really fun all right that's my favorite sticker storage ideas um, if you have any ideas that you love please share them down below in the comment section so we can 
give each other some more ideas. These are just ways that I love to store my stickers. Uh, I love these sticker boxes. I love baskets and wire crates. Also, if you're a Ray Dunn fan, um, she has a ton of cute little baskets that hold Happy Planner stickers. So that's another idea as well. You could definitely pick up some of those fun little baskets. That would be cute. Um, so yes, those are going to be my sticker storage ideas. Let me know which ones you love and let me know if you have some other ideas and ways that you like to store stickers down below in the comment section. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe. I hope you have an incredible day and I will see you in the next video.